Hey guys, um, so I'm fixing to get why well, I'm ready <laughs> to go out and pick up um, a drive up order from Target. And I have to go get groceries, which I know I have to do all the time and I hate it, but you know, we gotta do what we gotta do. I don't, there's a lot of things that I need. And so I'm gonna go get those. And um, I got recycling I need to throw out. I'm trying not to forget anything. That's it, I think. <clears throat> and then I want to come home and clean up. My house is a disaster. It's looking very terrible. <laughs> I don't know how the kids got a hold of my napkins and destroyed that so yeah so i'm gonna watch this video i'm gonna make my coffee i'm i think that's it i should just get my things together and go and get the things that i need to get done done oh yeah i have a prescription i have to pick up from cvs i better not forget that i always do i always forget it i need to make a little route that i need to take and that's it. I want to come home and be with my kids and clean up. And yeah, hopefully get this video out today. Oh, and I got a microphone coming today from Amazon for, um, for the garage office. That would be nice. The previous video. Sorry, the kids are playing. Um, the previous video. <laughs> oh, my God. I sounded like I was so tired and I didn't like I was not excited at all and that was because my microphone is installed in the room in our master bedroom and Julio sleeps until like one in the afternoon so he can uh, go to work and I was in there trying to trying to do my voiceover while he was sleeping and I think at one point you hear him snoring in the back um, yeah <laughs> so I'm gonna put my microphone in the garage office and yeah I'm excited I'm really excited it's the same kind of microphone that I have now uh, a Samson but yeah I I splurged a little bit I just did a lot of splurging this weekend, which I shouldn't have done. I mean, I like everything that I've got, but just my heart hurts and my bank hurts. So yeah, I'm gonna get that installed today, hopefully. Hopefully I can get it done without Julio because, you know, Julio's the master <laughs> of almost everything in this house. Um, especially with electronics he's the master so hopefully I can I can figure it out myself um, and that's it look at that so much space doesn't that look so good that looks so good that still needs to go back. I want to put some of that stuff back in my Jeep actually right now. Doesn't that look so good? There's like so much space. I mean, right here doesn't look like great. I should put some of that stuff out and see if the garbage man will take it. But I'm so happy. I know this stuff looks like looks terrible, but. Hopefully I can get it out soon. Those uh, nobles, I'm gonna try to sell on the Mercari. Uh, and maybe that sports bra. I really love that sports bra, I wanna take it back. I don't know, I don't know. I have so many freaking bras now. I don't know why I bought those last set of three. I really liked them and I, they were pretty cheap. I, I think that's what got me. <sighs> yeah, but. I'm seriously thinking that I'm going to put all that stuff out by the mailbox and be like, everybody, 
take what you want. Just take it. Take it. But I don't know. Julio would not be happy, I don't think. Hey guys. So, yeah. What I didn't realize on this day is that Julio had already put the cardboard in my Jeep. <laughs> so, yeah. And he actually put everything in there. All I needed to do was just put my things back in the Jeep. Like my reusable bags and my gym stuff. And yeah. stuff in my jeep i guess so that i don't forget to toss them but normally he doesn't do that kind of stuff so i'm gonna make a list real quick i got to let's see from here to the city i got to stop if i don't make a list then i'll completely forget everything and like I always do. I always forget something. So I want to stop at the CVS first and get my prescription. Then I need to stop at the FedEx and drop these pants off. Then from there, I'll go to the Publix. Oh no. Before the CVS, I need to stop at the recycling center. Hmm. Maybe the car wash, but I doubt it. I don't want to wait for the car wash. <laughs> My car really needs a car wash. I just, I don't know that I want to stop. Um and wait. Waiting for the car to get washed is the worst, I think. <sighs> okay. So, I have a lot of stuff to do. I keep my little uh, list of things. It's not cute like the girls on YouTube do, but these are, are the days that I was thinking I was going to try to work um, for this next coming out. Uh, self-schedule but I think some of them have gone array you know they're I don't know how I'm gonna get scheduled because I was late I'm so dumb I was late to get self-schedule so everybody had picked out the good days and I'm left with like the weekends and I called my manager and I was like I cannot work all the weekends I'm sorry I cannot um and she told me to just tell her the days I want to work. So I doubt she's going to give me all my days. But it'd be nice. All right. It's time to go. At least I got the cardboard taken out of, and now my garage looks a little bit better. But now I'm waiting at the CVS. Uh, I hate getting prescriptions. I think that's why I always forget to get them, because I just hate it. God, I was going to do something.
I don't know why I always find that hilarious. The little chipmunk talk. <laughs> but yeah, I finally got them. Oh, and sometimes I let my prescriptions lapse. So yeah, I gotta be more careful. Yeah, I was able to do a, all the things that I needed to do on this day. So sick for any luck to come. And if you really think about it, I should be able to do everything I'm supposed to do every day. I just, you know, I get tired of being out for a long time. And live good. Especially doing errands that's no fun. So this has totally been on my nerves, just having to get out at the grocery store and having to buy groceries all the time. But I decided to go in there for uh, the sushi because it was early and they have the kind of stuff that I like. So yeah, that's the reason why I went in there. But normally I try to get the drive up order. I'm so glad that they started the drive up stuff. I mean, that's one good thing, I guess, that came from the pandemic is the drive ups. Because for me, having to get out at the store and having to walk around is the worst and especially when they're trying to sell you all kinds of stuff and for me I like to browse I decided I shouldn't put the cucumbers back on the top shelf like I did last time I'm just so nervous that that glass on top will break which I don't think it should because I'm thinking that they make glass strong enough for all kinds of heavy things but it still freaks me out so yeah Also, I don't know how many people do this, but I do this, um, where I wait till the last minute to get all my errands done. So like, when I'm off, like yesterday I worked. So today, mostly I, <laughs> I like to be lazy and just kind of chill at home and nap if I want to nap. And tomorrow, I'll rush and get all the things I need to get done done, which sometimes causes me anxiety because I need to, <laughs> I need to run to the store and do all sorts of things um, before I have to work the next day. It's probably just me that does that, but I, yeah, I don't know why I do it. It's it's terrible. So I've been like on a shopping binge. I don't, you probably have noticed. 
uh, I bought these little cereal canisters here uh, because I like to take my cereals out of the box and leave them in just the bag because I don't need the box but I decided I wanted to buy the little cereal uh, bins and so I bought these at the Marshalls and I liked them I thought they were cute and I still do like them but did I need them I didn't need them yeah so I try to avoid <laughs> just shopping for things but I did and I have been and I need to stop But you know that doesn't really stop me very much like for canisters and stuff yeah I'll stop but like I always have to get something I don't know is that a girl thing you always feel like shopping I don't know but when I was out on this day I was like I went to the Publix and the Marshalls is right nearby and I was like, I feel like walking over there and seeing what they have, if they have anything nice. And so I did. I did leave a lot of stuff that I was going to get, so I'm proud of that at least. But I do like these little OXO bins. Um, these this brand is one of my favorites i i think they make a lot of nice things and a lot of durable things so yeah i'm glad i got them but did i need them i didn't need them already packing come with me i'm not really asking we'll get away to a place where we don't know About to see The world in action What we can be Life with no distractions We'll get away This is what we waited for Take my hand, we'll make it So I was thinking that I'm gonna Maybe, I'm not sure I might start putting my videos on a schedule like on Friday and Sunday for uploading but that's just an idea and um, you guys can let me know what you think but that would probably relieve some of my anxiety I was trying to think of a word um, yeah maybe relieve is a good word relieve my anxiety of putting up stuff um, very often but I don't know sometimes when I think of something I get so excited to put it out and uh, see you guys' reaction to it that I just can't help myself but put it out but I just thought a schedule would be nice a classic cliche we're on the run this is what we god so with that binge spending i'm gonna call it a binge because that's what it what it is what it feels like um i bought a bench for my office area desk and i bought it from target which doesn't change the fact of the bench that i i didn't really like it it was like it didn't seem it seemed very like cheap looking so I didn't I didn't record it um, you might see it later on but I think I'm gonna return it it was a hundred dollars and it's like a 
hundred dollars in the garbage because it doesn't look good. It, I liked it online, but now that I have it out and put together and all, it didn't look good. So I'm going to return it. There's no reason to keep it when I'm trying to keep things that I love and and I really need and can use and not just stuff just to have stuff. So I get down and pick up all the stuff on the floor, like the cotton and stuff, because, um, yeah, I don't want the vacuum to try to, you know, pick that up. It just, it, I feel like it's going to damage the vacuum and I don't, I don't think the vacuum is made for that. So yeah, I know that my poop heads are going to tear their toys up and, and all, and I'm going to have to do this all the time. <laughs> is get down and get stuff on you know manually but I know that when I buy them toys and they love the toys and I love to watch them play with the toys so yeah I don't mind Guys, I know this is, you know, probably a weird thing to say, but those Crocs, and I just thought about it when I, when I saw them there, those Croc sandals um, have really been one of my favorite, favorite sandals um, because they're comfortable and I can use them for anything really. I can take them out and get them dirty and nasty and then just wash them and they look they look fine. Um, I know that's that's just a random thing to say, but I just saw them and I was just thinking like sometimes I I look for them because I'm like I don't know, they're just some of my favorite ones. Um, so yeah, if you have a chance to buy some, I would, I would suggest that you buy some because they really are like good for everything. Not for the rain. <laughs> Don't take them out in the rain on a rainy day. You'll get your feet wet still, but for anything really, they are really awesome, awesome sandals. Don't you just love whenever you find something, you buy something and it's like one of your favorite, favorite things. Like you just, when they're gone, you don't know how you're going to live without them. <laughs> I love those kind of things. I used to have these leather shoes and I didn't, I don't know still what brand they were. Um, but back when I used to work at the PetSmart, I used to still wear them all the time and God, I don't even know what happened to them. I loved those shoes. They were the most comfortable shoes and they were so easy to put on and you didn't even have to tie them. They were just so awesome. And I don't have an idea of what even happened to them. I don't even know how I got them. But if, if I could find out what kind of shoes they were and buy them again, I would. They were awesome. And I just love that kind of stuff. Like the stuff you you regret having to throw out. And you use them even when they're so old because they're just so comfortable and or they're just made so well.
So yeah, I didn't, um, I didn't vacuum this little bench here or this ottoman, whatever you want to call it, because that little thing gets so filthy all the time. It just, it just does. So, uh, I didn't, on this day, this is just a quick clean. I didn't feel like getting deep, like getting a deep clean on it. For me, I feel like a lot of times there's no use. I'd, I'll do it sometimes just so it doesn't like build up. But yeah, this is just a quick clean here. Oh, but when I get that headboard, oh my God. I'm still thinking of that headboard. It's gonna look so good. And I'm gonna have to do something about this bed, like really fix it up and it's gonna look so good. I can't wait to get it. Eventually I'll get it, not right now. I'm taking a little break of my spending, my spending spree that I've had recently, but yeah, I can't wait. <laughs> Hopefully soon so I don't miss out on it. Soon-ish, yeah, soon-ish. I don't know why I've been in love with these sweet potatoes like I don't even put anything on them I just put them in the air fryer and they get so like they get so good I, I don't know there's something about them I just gotta have them but I just need to kind of slow down on my eating because I've been really failing failing hard on my diet uh, yeah I'm not happy about it. The feeling lingers on every day of every month. Wishing I just could forget about you. The way to put my Can you tell I love that <laughs> cold brew coffee? This super coffee, the vanilla kind, it was really not good. Um, if you tried it and you liked it, then then good. I'm glad. I'm glad you liked it. But for me, I I did not like it. I had to give it away because I could not drink it. gym area has been so abandoned look all that dust <laughs> I'm so ashamed the little baby gate that we've put up there has really kept everybody out even me
So Julio came out here and organized this garage a little better yesterday. <laughs> um, he just, I asked him to clean up from the mess that we had. He had his boxes um, from the recliner that he bought or we bought. Um, I bought that little basket today at the Marshalls. Um, it's got a little thing on the side. I don't know if you can see it. It says dog toys. But I'm going to use it for like knickknacks, whatever. Because I had stuff on top of that um, table and I don't want to have, I don't want to clutter the table up on the top there. Um, but so far it's been looking really good. I've decided I might keep that because we have it already. Might as well keep it, right? I don't know. You know I go back and forth with things. But yeah, I'm thinking I might keep that because Julio wants to keep it. And it'll just save me some money anyways. Um, I mean, I've been spending a lot of money lately. I need to quit it. Um, but my, I've managed to keep my shelf pretty, looking pretty good. I still haven't put up those hooks. Um, and I put a couple of stuff up here that I don't know what to do with and I might organize today. Let me close this. There's a stupid fly out here. I hate flies. Um, yeah. So I might organize this just a little bit. I mean, there's not much to do. Oh, I got this. I took Luna out the other day to Julio's work. Uh, he wanted to show her off. Um, to his um, co-workers so I took her and I didn't have like a bowl to give her water so I bought this little travel bag for doggies and I can put like toys and T-R-E-A-T's you know yeah I can put stuff like toys to keep, keep them occupied and um, these are made for for a little food. Let's see how I can. Yeah, they're like little lunch bags. Um, this bag came with two, and it came with little bowls. little bowls to give them water and food if you want to so yeah it's very nice I don't know what to put up there but this in case you're going out and traveling yeah so yeah very nice I got that at, on Amazon I'll put the link in the description it was like 40 bucks, not much, and it's nice. But yeah, now I just gotta figure out where to put it to kind of keep it nice somewhere. I might keep it over there actually. That might be a good spot for it. So yeah, my microphone got here. So yeah, I love my desk out in the garage. I love it. Look, I've got little headphones and uh, little stuff um, with my microphone, which was awesome. It was really cool. I really, I really like it. But I wasn't able to install it myself. Yeah. So um, when Julio has a chance, I'm going to get him to go out there and see what I did wrong. <laughs> it's probably the most simplest thing. Um,
yeah I bet it's the most simplest thing and I just didn't know what to do like how to fix it but yeah either way I love it it looks cool and I feel cool out there <laughs> yeah that's that's the important thing it's feeling cool no it's not I'm just saying um yeah don't don't mind me I I'm not funny um, yeah, that's it for today, guys. Thank you for joining me. Um, if you'd like to subscribe, I'd love to have you guys. Um, yeah, there's a couple of ways to subscribe and I'm going to start an Instagram, uh, a, yeah, I'm starting an Instagram. I just did like yesterday and so I'm going to start posting just, you know, updates and small things up there. So if you'd like to follow me, I'll put my tag or my name here for you guys. I'd love to have you guys and I'd love, I'd love to see that little platform grow. I'm not thinking it's going to be anything like super like to make money off of it. I mean, if I did, I... I wouldn't mind that either, but it's mostly to update you guys because sometimes I just like to be like, what's up guys? How are you doing? You know? And <laughs> it, it gives me that little, that little extra something, you know? All right, guys. I love you guys so much. Um, hit me with a thumbs up if you like it, if you like my video and, um, don't forget to hit the bell so you can get notified whenever I post a video. Anyways, I love you. Alright, I'll see you next time, okay? Alright, bye.